Hey guys, Warrior here, and welcome back to Dying Light 2, episode 106. For today, uh, you forgot what I said we would do, but that's okay. We picked the nearest mission and we do it. Well, oh wait, wasn't it there? Right, we did the history lesson. And now it's time for the oh, night mission. Yay! Uh, right, dang it. It's not a closer but to that mission. No. <laughs> Ah, if, there was, if there was a bed right by the mission, I would have ran over to it and done it. But here we go. Into the night of horrors we go. Ah. I hate it already. I hate it. <laughs> ah. No. Music, you are not helping. I need to... Oh, crud, there's one over there already! I need to mark that mission. Oh. Right, okay. Like, there we go, I guess. I guess I can only accept that mission during the day. Well, I'm glad. Wait until morning. <laughs> Oops. Uh... Okay. At least it'll allow us to switch to nighttime right then and there where we are. So I forgot about that. Right, we're okay. No need to stress yet. Until about two minutes later. Uh, isn't this fun? <coughs> Okay! Gee whiz, cause go away! Okay, why are you yelling at the zombies? Hey little guy, where are your parents? I'm not little. Okay, sure. What are you doing here alone? I'm on an important mission. Oh, a mission, huh? Alright, what kind of mission? Secret mission, of course. Super secret. And I ain't telling you. Would you tell me if I offered to help? I don't need any help. But if you've got to know, I'm fetching food for my parents. I do it all the time. No biggie. Seems dangerous. Couldn't your parents at least come with you? Nope. But like I said, no biggie. I can handle it. I can handle anything. Hey, listen. You're incredibly brave. But I'd really like to help. Uh, I suppose I could bring you on board. Heck, I can even pay you. How's that? So now kids are hiring me. Why not? What are your orders, sir? There's a shop on West Horizon Lane, just before you hit the chemical zone. I was lighting backpacks with food when those nasties showed up and chased me out. Bring me those backpacks, and I'll give you a super weapon. My dad's weapon. So, the mission's to get food for your parents. Yeah, that's right. And you can deliver it to our home. We live on the edge of the chemical zone. Only place where my parents are safe. Hmm. It would be best to get the backpacks at night, when the infected aren't around. Sure. If you say so. I don't know. But you'll do it, right? I can't promise anything. We'll see. Oh, okay. Well, see you soon. Hopefully. Yay! Let's just switch it to night time right now! Oh, flip. The amount of times I've done these missions, it's like, yeah, sure, no problem. And you night time is making this a whole new experience for me! And I don't like it! Sure, all these screams and echoes around the city as all the monsters come out at night. Sure. What's that? I don't know what that is. Climb up, climb up, climb up. He's seeing me. Climb up. 
Actually, roar and call the oh, volatiles over. I'm not even going the right way. <laughs> ah! I'm stuck. Safe zone. Who's in your safe zone? In the safe zone. Ow! Run, 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 run! Ah! This is a dark hollow. No! Ah! Crying out loud, where's the movie light? <laughs> Climb, man, dang it! So scary! Hey, um, right the near safe zone towards my actual target, there's a night runner's hideout right there. So if I ever get chased, run in that direction. I, <laughs> oh my days! a weapon, I'll take it. Inventory full. Well, then, um, you're stronger than the modified katana all by yourself, so I guess I'll swap you out. Then was the weakest thing then. Gee, I got a weapon 362. Wow! That's a good weapon. Some crystal dust, another immunity booster, and some more armor. We'll see if they're better later. Okay, back out into, out into the horrors. I'm gonna go this way. Where am I? What is this? Oh, oh, I thought, okay. Where'd you go? Get back here. I think it's one of those is not a volatile. I thought there was a volatile right on me. Why are you gonna try and jump on me from underneath the building? Good luck with that. Well, underneath the roof, not building. Oh, I'm here where the thing was, the... 
Maybe we have to go down into the military garage. We can still open this door? I didn't know that. We can actually go back down there. Who's staying in here? Ah, where'd you go? Okay, I really have to move as much as I'm pooping my pants, wait a I have to go. <laughs> oh my word! Okay, if I go this way onto the. Go, 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 go. Whew, you almost saw me completely there. What's that? A throwing spear! Take that! <laughs> I got a spear spinning at me. A volatile rail over there. Go pick it up quickly. Yeah. If I ever get chased, run that way. Run towards the objective. Great, there's a volatile on the other side of this roof. He's going down. Good, I'm going up. Ooh, it's one of these places. We need these things. Crafting materials. Is that everything? I feel like I'm missing something. Right, the weapon, but it's trash. It's even worse than the worst weapon I have. One or two right down there, actually. I love it. Nope. Hide in the grass. You don't see me. Don't come over this way. I know I can turn on my flashlight, but if I do so, he's gonna see me. There's nothing in this grass, don't worry about it. I make sure he doesn't see me. I have to go this way, though. I thought he jumped over there in the building, but didn't. Don't go that way! I gotta go that way! He's going down. Alright, he's going, going over to that building there. He's now over there. Past this is two down below me. Great, he's going over the other building, building as well. Meaning, I can now cross over to here where he was. And safely cross over here without falling down to the other two below. No, 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 you see nothing. You, you see nothing. Uh, I just hear them climbing around. Oh, right, 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 right behind me. Hey, so just stay over there, and that's where I need to be. There's this guy right there. Ah! I'm surrounded. Now I want to go back. How many do I have around me? One, two, three, four of them. Two down on the ground there. If you don't know what I'm looking at, you see these little white, white dots? Those are the guys that are super duper deadly. 
And they were the ones who were chasing me earlier. <laughs> they called Wallet or something. And I got that, that guy's over there. I thought there was one climbing up to me right now. <laughs> uh, what do I do? Eh, yeah, sure, no volatiles. Big brave boy. Come to volatiles. Biggest scaredy cat you've ever seen in your life. Ah, uh, great. I'm gonna try and get past this guy somehow. No, you just you see me anger. You saw nothing. I don't exist. Don't come here. My word, I think the entire night is just to get to my location. No, don't come to this building. Okay. Okay, buddy. No, 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 no. Not karate. To the safe house! Biggie! Run! No! How is a thing like this even safe from them? Thanks to the UV lighter, at least. Hey, you can't get to me now, can ya? Come on! Oh. Go away! I got things to do! Shoo! Go away! Well now you can clearly see what I'm running from and hiding from. All these ones all around the whole... How are you not this close? No! He's just gonna see me over and over! Get out the building! Go away! You're making things really difficult, you know! Get off the building! I'm sleeping. <laughs> to make him go away, and I'm sleeping again to make it night time again. Because he's not being a real jerk. <laughs> okay. Our mission's back on. And the flowers are back, but I can't harvest them. Now it's my time to go immediately, before these things actually come out again. Awesome. Alright, and uh, in the actual shop itself, the abandoned store, and there's no volatiles in here. How lovely. We deal with these zombies, no problem, but those things will take like 20 hits each to kill. We've tried killing a few before, and uh, what was it? Oh, it wasn't too long ago. Uh, what was the episode's name again? Was it? Uh, was it the one with the dog? Yeah, it was the one where we tried to find Scott and Mo. Uh, what was that mission called? I forgot now. Bags of food, he said. They say it. Got nothing from that bag. Taking that and that. Ah! What? 
Oh, great! That means basically now, is there a Howler in every, like, Dark Hollow and Forsaken store? Should I press the fire alarm? I'm sure that'll be lovely. Just surround the entire building with all those holes and fire rolls and <laughs> all the zombies I could think of. Yep, here's the backpacks. Time to go feed that family. Sure, well, let's grab these things and loot these things. And open this if I can. Oh, there goes one lockpick. I wonder if I'll run out of lockpicks before I finish the game. I craft I don't know how many, but I'm just curious. Okay, that's everything. We got what we needed. Man. Before these small volatiles came, we would have probably already been done with this mission. We probably would have even done it during the day. There too. Ow! Who's that spitter? The spitter sees me. I spit an acid at me. No, you see nothing. Oh crud! Oh crud! Oh crud! I'm going. I'm running. Safe zone. Sleep. <laughs> Things are terrifying. Oh. My word. Okay, now we can go deliver the food to the kids. Get to him again. Is there a window open in the ha! Excuse you! I'm trying to find a way in which I might just have. Hi. Shh. Sleep. really made this game scary. Like, when it just came out, it was fine! I don't think I could just walk over to him. Oh boy, is this... It's here! Finally! Did you get the supplies? Uh... What about the pair of virals? Hey, listen. Those two. You are aware that you have... Are you talking about my parents? Well, that, that is... Those are your parents? That's what I said, isn't it? Mom, Dad, look who's here. I told you he wouldn't take the food and run. I know. I know you're hungry. I... What do I do? I mean, he, he knows, right? Uh, just take your food. Uh, right. Right here. Awesome. Thanks. Here, Mom. Here, Dad. Enjoy. Bye now. See you tomorrow. Hold on. I'll be back to feed you again. And here you go. This is the super weapon. My dad won't be needing it anymore. Thanks again. My parents are also grateful, as you can see. Man, that's just sad. I wonder if that thing is actually still as bad as it was. 
at first, or if it actually like scaled with the new game plus mode. I don't know. Let me see. That is. Oh wait, my inventory's full. So I think that would have gone to my backpack. Well, the safe, the safe house is just here, and that's like my backpack here. Uh, more uh, over here. Uh, oh. My backpack not here. Is it really only just the bed? Well, that sucks. Okay. That's fine. Well, let's see. What is next on the list here? Um... We do have this mission here, our Boyd's Diva. Yeah, let's go do it. I might be wondering why I haven't explained this yet. I, I, I've explained it in um, Grid Legends Episode 6. But I haven't explained it in Dying Light yet. Long story short, if you want the, the, the majority of the rules, the new rules, the new changes coming to the channel, then you're going to have to go over to the Grid Legends Episode 6. But... In short, all my videos from now on has to be 30 minutes plus. Meaning, I'm playing it like I did with Need for Speed Hot Pursuit Remastered, doing as much as I can within 30 minutes. We haven't hit 30 minutes yet, so I'll do D.Va, finish D.Va, and then the episode's over. Yeah, great, now the Renegades are coming to fight me. I ain't got time for you, I gotta do D.Va and help her with her problem. Whatever your problem is. Yeah. Hey, come on, go up, go up. There you go. How many renegades are around? Oh my days. I don't want you right now. Uh -oh. Well, guess it let go of me! No way! I'm claiming a bike. Ah, oh, great. Now I can't go. Alright, now over to this way. Oh, I keep pressing all the wrong buttons. Climb up this. Shouldn't be too far now from Diva. Uh, just another 150 meters to go. Oh, nice. So our main mission is... It was that way. Oh, now the intense music is fading away. And now it's back again. Uh, you telling me that music is like a 300 to 400 meter radius? It's kind of nuts. for the big night? Where did you come from, handsome? I heard you, uh, singing. Don't lie to Lola, sweet cheeks. Bet you thought someone was strangling a cat. No, not at all. I, I... See this neck? You shouldn't be able to. Usually, it's wrapped in the softest, most rare of mink stoles. Lola was the grand dame of the bazaar. But until reunited with her beloved mink stole, she is unfit to perform. 
But how will Lola dazzle anyone without her beloved mink stole? Without it, I can't hit the high notes. And you don't see mink scampering about everywhere, do you? And where is it? Earlier, a strong gust of wind ripped it from Lola's tender throat and carried it away. I saw it flapping from the scaffolding near the GRE quarantine at the intersection of Market and Horseshoe. Lola is powerless to retrieve it. Uh, I could. Would you? Lola could return to the bazaar to entertain that frightened children like a lurking screamer. Now we can't have that. No, indeed. Thank you, my knight in shining... Whatever it is that you're wearing. <laughs> I shall await you at the bazaar. Hurry, my fans await. <laughs> okay. Dima is... Right. Pretty much gotta go to where I just came from. How lovely. Okay. This way. Okay. Okay, here we go. No damage taken. That's nice. That's boost. Let's keep going. I'm trying to best to not be grabbed by any zombies. Right, so over there, that way, up that, okay, uh, okay, let's see, I probably need to approach that from the ground up. I'm now getting flashbacks of the Hubert mission. Ow! Slap me, I'll slap you back! Right. Okay. There it is. I get that scarf back. Grab it! Damn. Almost had it. Now the wind. The wind's taking it. <laughs> Come on, get away! Oh, and it's done again. Ah! Wind! Stop it! Man, tell you, wind! Get here! Got it! Oh, looks more like Squirrel than Meg. Well, I better get to the bazaar and give this to Lola. Okay, then I went to the bazaar, which is actually quite nice because there's some more missions in that area. Excellent! Um, what's the best way down? Probably down to this building here. Roll, roll, roll! We did it. Took a little bit of damage due to the physical protocol, but that's okay. I don't care about you guys. Yeah! I gotta get to the bazaar! Man, oh man. Is it just a thing, like, how I used to play some of these missions before the um, volatiles were introduced into the night? All just running around, running into the Forsaken stores during the day, or in the dark hollows during the day. Not anymore. Because those things will tear me apart. Okay, let's see. Now where is Lola at? Actually, before I talk to her, I want to check my gear. As soon as it loads up, there we go. Let's see, I apparently also have a skill point that I saw pop up. Um, let's put one in Brute as well. There we go. Right, inventory, and armor-wise, anything here? What is this? I have 11 and that is 11. 
gloves. Only have that one. Dad, I got a few things here, but they're called they're all trash. And here, I'm wearing one that is currently eleven. Nice, also fine. And pants-wise, I'm gonna have to sell that one in, in the boots. Nah, no armor. That's more for the medic class, not for my tank classes. I love to run. Are you back here? Hey, Damien. Hey. Hey. How are you holding up? No plans for flying lessons from any nearby tower anytime soon. Good to hear that. I get up each day and try to make it through. So far, I'm succeeding. I never thanked you. You saved my life. Still not entirely sure I deserve it, but thank you. Hey. Oh wow, I actually never, I never ever came to speak to him again. It's the first time I hear that. Well, you're also a shop, you're also a shop over there. What's the difference between you and the other guy? Is there actually a difference? Well, what kind of weapons do you have? The 350 and the crappy kind? Hmm. I think I might as well sell my stuff to you. Inside me here, my armor. I'm gonna do it over there anyway. As we make our way through the bazaar to reach Lola to give her her scarf or her mink. Is there actually a difference between the two? Alright, that's sorted. Hey, Lola! No? Here you go. My precious mink! Oh, you are truly sent from above. Lola is complete once more. You deserve a reward. Do you wish Lola to reward you with a song? Oh, what do I do? What did I do last time? Ah, oh, let's just go for it. Sure, why not? <sighs> you were sent from above Like a soft turtle dove I will <laughs> to the touch of your lips Your hands are my hips My heart does bad flip My window is still standing! Are you not hypnotized? Are you not enthralled by Lola's voice? I am! I am. That was otherworldly. Such a compliment! You were such a dear boy. And a terrible liar. But Lola appreciates your kindness. You deserve a more proper reward than a song anyway. Take this with Lola's deepest gratitude. <laughs> Thanks. Well, I at least it'll have windows. <laughs> oh, man. Hey, we all start somewhere. What strikes your fancy? Uh, Alberto, was it? Can I upgrade anything? Why didn't we loot any zombies that could give me like unique trophies or anything today? But I guess that's fine. Right. Is that Lola? Is that Lola coughing like that? Or what? I don't know. We're a bit far away from Lola for that, but wow. Anyway, uh, let's see. How many missions we got left around here? By the looks of it, just three. This one here. What is it? The essence of survival. Oh boy. And then all in the family. There's another one over here, which is. 
fish monk. Right. A fish monk is such a short mission. I feel like running over to this windmill here real quick. Ending the episode over there. We start off next time with fish monk right away. We run over here to start all in the family. And go back into the nighttime horrors again. And then, if there's time, the essence of survival? Oh, and there's this one here, too. Expiration date challenge. Oh, boy. Fun! My total is about to listen. We only have one nighttime mission left. I don't know if I should worry about the GRE sensors. The quarantine buildings. No, I don't know. Because he's, we've already done that and they won't change much. Let me leave and then go over to... That windmill, so we can end things off there. Then be right close to fish and can do that then. Let's see what else we can do within 30 minutes. In the next episode then. You first gotta get over there as I terribly miss that ramp. Oh, I can't speak. Oh, yeah, it happens so often. Yeah. Right, uh, just 120 meters of this away. I can probably go over here. Can I jump from here to there? Oh. Almost. Not quite though. Ah, I can't even get up there. Uh, let me move right there. I should perhaps, if possible, jump on that little thing. Can I, can, I, can I get in here, please? Thank you. Pressing the button to climb up and over and over, but I didn't want to climb over. And uh, let's see. Got some ranks, some more armor. Probably not good, but we don't know. No, that is more for the. That's for the medical class. Anything else in here? There's a bag. Some leather. Okay, and I gotta go this way. Uh, I probably gotta go from here to there, which should be fine. Ow. And here we are. Nice. Like I said, this windmill has already been cleaned by the survivors. It's in the bizarre area. Uh, meaning my bed is just over here. I want to see that weapon. I don't remember what his damage was last time, but this is it. <laughs> yeah. Uh, 31 damage weapon is gonna do me no good when I am in need of damage level like 400 plus. Should I stick to a level and call that I only want the 350s? To jump up another level by another 50 points in damage? Instead of wasting my time going through the, the, the 310 and the other ones, just immediately say I want only X. Because that's what basically what we're getting. Unless we find a really crappy weapon, which they still are around, even the shopkeepers sell them. But still. Hmm. Yeah, I could go sell those off real quick. The child keeper is just over here. And then we can go tackle the fish monk in the next episode. Yeah, that's 313. Sell it. 310. Anything below 350. Must go. Giving me space for some nice weapons. And some extra rewards as well. 314. We fully modified now. 314. Mamma mia. 
I think that's everything. Yeah, these up here are all really strong weapons, which we'll get to eventually as the others break. And so on and so forth. But now we have extra space for new weapons. What are you selling anyway? Yeah, below 350s. We're actually more than they there selling, which is kind of good. Anyway, I guess I'll take this. You know your business. Just in case, and that as well. Armor-wise, do you sell anything good? No. What is that thing I picked up? Yeah. yeah sell that I too. Right. Don't be a That's all the stuff done and dusted, and then our next mission is a fish monk, which is just behind us, actually. Like I said, we'll tackle that, and then go over to... All in the family, and then see how much time you have left to tackle the other mission. But I'll have to wait until the next episode. So, if you guys are into the first episode or the previous episode of Dying Light 2, you guys can go to the beginning of the video. There will be two cards popping up there. You can click on those if you are interested. There's also two links in the description. One link will take you to the Dying Light 2 players. And the other one will take you to my website. If you are interested, they will all be in the very bottom of the description. And so, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like. Share it if you really liked it. Comment and subscribe if you wish. And I shall see you guys in the next video. Peace out.